morning happy it is thursday today <laughs> after my little goof up yesterday it's thursday i just finished playing tennis and i could wear my contacts for once she said that i could wear them sh for short increments at a time so i went i put new contacts in got new clear care a new container i already put the contacts in to be clean before i put them in for tonight's match i feel much better being able to at least do that try not to get too excited but our son who is in the military is moving they're changing his station so he is right now right around the dc area and they're moving him to california so he gets 30 days off in between and he's coming here first he said he would be here for about a week, excuse me. And I think he's staying for like 10 days. It has been years since I've seen him for that long. Years. I, before boot camp, which was in February of 2020. So I'll, I'll try not <laughs> to let my art explain. He also wanted to go to the beach, which, mind you, he doesn't like doing things like that, but I think he's changing because he asked if we could go to the beach. And of course, absolutely, <laughs> absolutely. What do you kids want? Absolutely. So we are going to the beach next weekend. I've, we've lived here two years and this is the first time that we're going to the beach. So we're taking three of the five kids and heading there with the dogs going to be a good time. To give you a little background, four out of our five kids were very athletic. They, they played volleyball, they swam, they played tennis, and Bailey, who is in the military, did things like this. I'll, I'll put a picture up here so you can see. This is what he loved to do. He loved also to trade engines from one car to the next. He loved teaching himself how to do manual labor, which is great. And we would go to the beach, <laughs> we would take him and he just had no desire. But darn it, he wants to go and we're going. Anyway, we're going to the beach and our daughter was here this past weekend, we had a great time. Some of them just don't want to be on film, camera, pictures, etc. So that's why I say they're coming, but I don't take pictures. So I'm hoping to snap a few this weekend. Hopefully they, <laughs> hopefully they'll let me. On today's agenda, I am going to be judging up this cabinet. I do this every year. I do a spring and a fall look. So let me flip the camera. This is a cabinet. Every spring I put my blue collection in here. It's not really even blue. It's kind of khaki and blue. But this fall I'm going to be putting my apple bowls. And I don't know, do I have any down here? No, I don't have any apple bowls. If you don't know what apple bowls are, they're right in there. Well, make... <laughs> Make yourself at home, little buddy. Able to get the doors off. It's so strange looking at it without them, but let's just try it. I'm going to clear all this out and start putting my apple bowls back in. I'm still, <laughs> I'm still binge watching. All the midwives I cannot get over that. I think I'm on season five. Anyway, I am trying to judge this up, and I don't. I don't know if I like it. So here is what I have so far. But when I stand back and look at it, there's just too much brown in the middle, and I don't have very much plain green. So I'm thinking about bringing this type of stuff in here mixed with the brown so it kind of all goes together. Sorry, I'm shaking because I'm using both hands. So I don't, 
I don't know. I don't know. Come here, side ponytail. <laughs> Someone just finished eating, so I guess I'm going to have to chase him. Come here, sweet boy. Did you just eat your lunch? Oh, good boy. I to mention that I'm going to Denton, North Carolina tomorrow. It's about 45 minutes away from here, and they have an outdoor flea market at this old... It, it looks like they have festivals there for other things. But there's like an old church, an old jail, a railway station. And I will see if I can find the name of it. But I will share some stories from last year. And I'm taking my roller, my wagon this time. Because last time I had to walk about a mile <laughs> several times because I found something. I couldn't carry it all. I had to take it to the car and all that stuff. So let me share some stories. This place is huge. I had no clue anything was here like this. And it's, it's, I don't know much about it. I'm gonna have to go home and research it, but there are all kinds of little places. I think Rob might be <laughs> getting his wish. He is not a fan of these. Just never has been. And the way this is turning out, I don't, I don't think I will be using them, sadly. Maybe I can find some other place to use them. I mentioned the Walmart order came in, and I will be sharing that probably tomorrow because I have a tennis match tonight. So all three pieces work. Even the one that I was a little skeptical about, it works. So I'm excited to share with you. Yeah, that will be tomorrow finished with a cabinet. I threw some pumpkins in, but I don't know if I, I like them, but I'll show you that tomorrow. I don't know what bug is. I just, <laughs> I just finished with tennis. It was a quick match. We got our, our patooties kicked, but that's okay just it's always it's it's very humbling I played a match not too long ago where we were literally getting <laughs> it was so embarrassing we were getting hammered and I remember walking back to the fence to get the ball and I was just telling myself joyful heart cheerful heart <laughs> and I decided that since we were down like we were really getting smeared it was like zero five and I stood back there and I hollered I hollered the scores <laughs> as loud as possible because I figured might as well own it right